The Central Library continues its outreach and engagement program with yet another activity, this time celebrating Creole Heritage Month in authentic style with staff and students. Kilte Se Jewizo, Culture Heals, was the theme for the morning, and according to Director of Library Services, Sally Rosedeman, it's important to expose young students to the Creole language and culture and find ways to excite them through reading, singing, dancing, and storytelling. It is with great pleasure that I welcome you to our Creole activity. We at the Central Library always take the opportunity to sensitize with the public and the youth under the theme Culture Hills in celebration of Creole Heritage Month. One of the highlights of the activity was storytelling. Storytelling is a cultural form that has a unique space and significance in St. Lucian culture and history. Deeply rooted in African culture, they are not just stories, but a traditional performance style, where the storyteller directly engages with listeners, encouraging them to respond and actively be part of the storytelling experience. We say to Avai, when the, the boss call him, he say, now is your pay because it's one day work, I, I, one day's work. So he come and say, boss, come here, come over. They, they tell him, well, who to Avai where Jordi at? Who to Avai where Jordi at? Look at my body rings. Look at my body lavi. So they give him a say, Afa. A hundred dollars and one cent. So his pay for that day was a hundred dollars and one cent. A single pumping boy. A single happy. Mr. Jopier took the time to explain the significance of storytelling and how important it was in the transmission of information and culture. But more importantly, it was used as a tool to teach important life lessons. Today we are celebrating Creole Heritage Month is a, a celebration of ourselves, our ancestors, the body of knowledge that we have accumulated in order for us to survive and create our own, um, what I would call our own civilization. It's a civilization that we have developed with the way we do things, how we do it. And it comes out of a number of the contribution of at least three ethnic groups. The staff of the Central Library also enjoyed a traditional dance session by Jason Bachelor Joseph, teaching dances such as the Mulala and Debot. At the end of the activity, students were invited to play traditional games. By all accounts, the activity was educational, fun, and all rooted in St. Lucian tradition and culture. From the Communications Unit of the Ministry of Education, Sustainable Development, Innovation, Science, Technology, and Vocational Training, I am Daniel Dubois reporting.